are back. Hopefully. Ooh. Yep, everything is looking good. If you are still there, we're just heading down the road to Woolies. This is uh this is the valley now. It's full of apartments. That's that's really pretty much it. Um Yeah, it's not too terrible, like, living, I think it's like three blocks away from a grocery store. I hope it's still open, I'm pretty sure it's still open. Like, we got, um, I don't know, like 9 p.m. trading hours around here for some reason. It's like the only part of Brisbane that has it. But, um, but yeah, I'm just gonna double check. Oh yeah, now it's gone. It's all good. So we kind of, we, I guess, scored and salted our eggplant earlier. It's got to sit for about an hour. So now is the perfect time to head down the road and, um, and do the grocery shopping for the things that I completely forgot to get earlier, which is pasta sauce, uh, cheese, and um, well, we ran out of rock salt while we are scoring them. So we need a little more of that. Um, oh. Yeah, like, I guess, it's a, it's a pretty nice walk down, it's a pretty nice night tonight, like just t-shirt weather, it has been getting a little cooler lately, which is, I mean, from summer, it's like, you gotta wear a jumper, but, other than that, it's pretty alright. I wonder if, um, if anyone came across it was watching before. So it is kind of a pain that just like a brief intermission between our door and the street is just like, nah, you get nothing. Maybe, hmm. I feel like it might be possible to fix that, but only one way to find out. What is this guy doing? <laughs> All over the shop. Hmm. Whoop, uh oh. Rip tripod thing. I hardly knew you. Oh, hey zombie flesh healers, I'm glad you made it back. Um, it is a beautiful night here. It is completely clear. Hey, hey how you doing? <laughs> and uh, and we are getting we are getting heckled on the street because I'm walking around with a camera and a mic. Um, it is it is really good temperature here. I would say we're gonna quickly scoot across here. <laughs> Let's see if we get any more hecklers. That's really entertaining. That's actually never happened to me before. <laughs> but you know, I'm also yeah, right. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't just that guy either. It was like his passenger in it. Oh, Doctor Hashbrowning, you're still here too. Um, yeah, there's kind of only so fast I can walk cruising at a leisurely pace. I could have like chucked it on the bike and gone down, but the bike and the and like the camera is just like shaky cam city. It is really unpleasant to watch. Although I imagine this is pretty shaky cam too. Hang tight. And I think I can like image stabilize this something in the hopes of oh so much. I'm gonna stop until I do this. In the hopes of making this less shaky cam. Oh! Everything has gone pear shaped. Alright. Oh no. No image stabilization for the selfie cam. Sorry guys. You're uh. You're stuck with it. 
Oh, sweet. Oh, that's good to know then. Wait, what beer, what kind of beer? I do love hearing about people's homebrew. It is pretty delicious. My brewing buddy sadly like disappeared to Canada. He was meant to be gone for a year, but he has not come back. I don't think he's coming back. So we gotta like find a new brewing buddy, but the last thing we did was a chocolate stout and it was fucking tops. It was so good. But I don't know, like you can't brew without a brew buddy, right? <laughs> Yeah, always on, always on the lookout for recipes because homebrew is delightful. Actually, super convenient. Dark ales, amber ales, use it. Yes, yes, please, please throw them at me. Oh, that sounds right up my alley. <laughs> that sounds, that sounds so good. How are you right now? Yeah, I am. Um, I actually like also packed a sneaky growler in a bag because we're gonna walk past a brewery and I'm gonna get it filled because uh yeah no I pretty much drank it last night so need something else you have a fantastic taste in beer my friend just absolutely tops yeah for me like the darker the better like Give me a stout, give me a porter, give me a brown. Like, so good. Either that or oddly like ciders. It's like either has to be super sweet or like deliciously dark and roasty and like puffy flavored. So I don't know why that's a thing, but mm, that's just how it is, I guess. It's not a terrible life. Like I'm pretty sure we live in the proximity of um, well, there's at least two breweries. There used to be a third, but it buggered off to South Bank. And, yeah, countless amounts of craft bars. So, uh, you know, rip my wallet. Whoop. Ooh. Two more blocks, almost there. No worries, zombie flesh eater, two, no worries. Come back whenever you want. This is, yeah. <laughs> you would, Dr. Hash Brownie, you would. Pretty sure you already know where we live anyway. <laughs> Creeper. Creepers be creeping. Actually, maybe you should be like creeping. That would maybe be a more appropriate nickname. Although I really do like Dr. Hash Brownie. I feel like. Like, I mean, did you have that Twitch name before? <laughs> Oh god, this is so hard to aim. <laughs> um, I don't want to say you couldn't. Oh yeah, solid, like, yeah, account, two hours old. Solid, you know, solid effort. I feel like it's a great Twitch name. You should start streaming. You can like, I know stream. Something. Your home adventures. We're definitely streaming your Nancy Poos, that's for sure. But... Ooh. One more block, almost there. It's really kind of weird, like... People seem... Yeah, that would be a good stream. I think people do that. Like, I've seen people, like... I don't know, stream, like watching YouTube and whatnot. <laughs> Zombie flesh eater is too sure. I'll just drop in on her and be like, hey, your brother said say hi. By the way, like, you're live on the internet. Have fun with that. 
I'd be too if you won. It'd be like, I don't know, it's not really Twitch plays Pokemon, it's like, Twitch controls where I go and who to talk to. That could be kind of fun, weird, but yeah, no, that, that would not work out well. Internet being in the internet. Gotta run across. Feel bad making a lid. Normally I just skip across like before, but that intersection is such a shit. It's just like, I don't know, always cars coming in some weird ass direction. Ooh. Yeah, so um, this I guess is, I guess it's Newstead. Um, pretty much like, all just apartments now there is um there's not much else yeah it's it is definitely still warm here like i'm just wearing a t-shirt and shorts and and it's pretty fine 23 degrees says uh says ye oldy google so like still very very nice weather i feel like we're pretty lucky um i'm definitely not complaining about it that's for sure I am not very good with the cold. Right. I'm gonna skip across here. Because another block of apartments is going up. Yeah, yeah, like we've come out of the like crippling heat and we're just into that nice mild, mild point in time, <laughs> or mild weather where you don't have to like sit in a sweat pool or track, you know, track down a pool every second day and you can actually walk around outside without needing to bring three changes of t-shirts. It's pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, we'll get into winter then. Hey, what's today? It's Sunday. I guess like, Sunday's pretty nice and chill. There might be people in Newstead, or Newstead Barinka. We will find out, but yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> uh, that aircon, man. The last last house we lived in. I mean, it was great, and we had fiber in it, and that was also great. But like zero insulation, just a Queenslander. You could see through the floorboards to the floor. So, like. You'd, you'd crank the aircon and it'd be good, but as soon as you turn that off, it's like, not nah, all of that cold air has seeped out, you've got nothing anymore. It is back to like being 35 degrees in here. Um, I feel like, oh yeah, this is Newstead Brewing Co. We're gonna come back later for that growler. Um, it is a delicious bre uh, brewery. And I'm pretty sure they brew all this stuff there. I don't know, maybe they don't. They got a couple of um, a couple of tanks. I'm sure there's something in them. But, um, Cream Gush, I'm talking to you, of course. I'm talking to you. Are you new here? This is Twitch IRL. This is kind of what we do. Haven't had um. Yeah, surprisingly, any hecklers. But we'll see how that goes. So we're about to go into Woolies and there's a lot more people there. This is gonna look pretty fucking weird. But wee 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 <laughs> What does it even mean? I don't know, maybe they'll just assume I'm a YouTuber or something and I'll end up on the YouTubes. Maybe that's a thing that happens these days? I don't know. Wee 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 wee. Like, what city is this? What year is this? It's, um, we're in Brisbane. So at the moment, we are down and we'll come up on it. I'm pretty sure it used to be like a gas works or something, but there is like 
that giant structure there behind me used to have like a giant spherical gas thing in it. Sauerkraut, dill pickles, and bread. That sounds like excellent setup for a Rubens on these. Yeah, Cream Gush, are you in Australia or are you, um, are you out and about somewhere else? Yeah, no, now this is like, I don't know, I gotta aim this right, but it's pretty much like old cafes and like fancy fish and chip shop and, and stuff like that. Like, even, I think I lived around here maybe five years ago and this was, this was just nothing and now it's super built out. There used to be a Canada. Oh yeah. Yeah, um, I don't know, I guess you can Google Maps it if you want. I don't know what the equivalent like in Canada or here would be though. Unless you've been out here before, in which case like welcome back to Brisbane. But yeah, no, there used to be a um oh, like super good roast roll place. But they um apparently didn't sign their or pay their lease, so they're not there anymore, very sadly. Yeah, no, it's in, it's insane, zombie flesh shooters. It is absolutely nuts. Another day if you want to tune in. I don't think I have time to do it today. But, like, we'll go for a walk just down Brunswick Street and around the valley and stuff. It, it is pretty crazy. Like... This is kind of interesting, but I am not going to stick around for it. <laughs> Welcome to Woolies. Oh shit, I need a... One of these guys. This pants. So if I lose you guys... Yeah, I mean, I don't know, shit happens. That guy, I think we got some... I should have put you in my shopping cart. I have a bad feeling I've lost you guys. Sources. Ah, oh, I need bloody rock salt as well. Herbs and spices, there we go. There's tomatoes. Half price ice cream. Pasta sauce. Two or one. 